Hey guys, I'm your average climber and welcome to the channel. Um, so I made this channel because I have built up an interest of rock climbing and I just wanted to sort of show you guys what I do, I guess, yeah. Um, so today we will be, um, I will be filming a what's in my bag video, my rock climbing bag. Um, this is my rock climbing bag. I've had this. Well, I actually like rock climb. I used to rock climb like a year or so ago, and then I, I can't even remember why I stopped. Um, but I did, and now I'm starting again. So I still have my rock climbing bag from when I did, and I ended up purchasing a myself a pair of rock climbing shoes that I've been saving and I purchased them myself my first ever pair my mom got for me for my birthday but I'm happy that I have invested myself anyway so we'll start in, in the big pocket so um, my rock climbing shoes they are the black diamond momentums um, they are quite comfy I usually wear a size 8 in like uh, shoes but they were just really really tight so I moved up to a 9 and they fit nicely still tight and snug but they are really nice they are actually a men's shoe I didn't realize that when I was buying them but potato potato whatever um because I do have quite a big foot so anyway this is them they're really nice they aren't an aggressive shoe, they're, I think on the boxes they're neutral, so this is them. I have them clipped together with a purple carabiner that I got from a water bottle, so yeah, that's my rock climbing shoes. I haven't got to try them out yet, so if I do post a rock climbing video, you probably will see me rocking these. I usually um, rent rock climbing shoes and they cost like... It costs like three or fifty for to rent them out, and I feel like it's just better to invest in a pair to last you a long time. Like Black Diamond, they're a well-known rock band, ba band brand. <laughs> so yeah, I think it was definitely worth the purchase. And next, I have the water bottle, the where I got the carabiner off. I got this from an outdoor shop. It is the the lettering is a bit scratched off. I don't know how, but it is. So yeah, I bring this along with me so I don't get parched. So yeah, that's my water bottle. And then of course, every rock climber needs a chalk bag. Like it's it's basically an essential. Um, I just my rock climbing center they sell these in in their um yeah in the rock climbing center. So there, I just have a chalk ball in there. I don't have like chalk I don't use liquid chalk I just use a chalk ball with a it's quite it's quite a small rock climbing bag I have big hands so it's usually just one at a time well that's what you do anyway it's not, okay so that's everything in the big pocket now we're gonna move on to the small pocket this video will probably be very short because I don't really have much in here so first thing I have is a hand exerciser. It's actually quite hard, but I've I at the start I couldn't really close it all the way, but now I can. Um, I have a that's upside down. I have a cookies and cream protein bar. I went through one of these when, last time I went rock climbing, and I have a little Ziploc bag with some plasters different sizes because you could I have some for like if you like hurt the back of your heel if you like accidentally cut, like cut your finger whatever and I have some hand cream slash lotion this is for after rock climbing because my hands get really dry because that's what chalk does so yeah I just have this and it's cruelty free so you know what Okay, I'm so clumsy. Anyway, yeah, that's my rock climbing bag. If you like this video, then you can press like. If you don't want to, that's fine. If you're new to this channel, which most of you will be, 
um, please hit that subscribe button and turn on bell notifications if you are interested in being notified every time I upload. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!